Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be creating this Kim K soft matte look. I've been dying to try to recreate this look in so long ever since Ariel or Makeup by Ariel posted it on his Instagram and I was like shook. I even posted it on my IG stories and so many of you guys were like, oh my god, you should recreate the look, you should recreate the look. So I went ahead and recreated it, finally. I freaking love how Makeup by Ariel just does his makeup. I'm not saying that it's identical, but I did, you know, try to mimic a little bit of it. Obviously, the look is not identical, but I, but I really, really, really did try on this look. So yeah, you guys, I hope you guys loved this sexy glam soft matte look and if you do and if you want to recreate it then please continue watching so first I'm gonna start by prepping my skin I'm gonna be using the hangover good and bad ultra replenishing hydrating serum it's this one right here I'm really really liking this serum it's super nice on the skin doesn't feel like you know, like it's clogging your pores like some serums do to me. And it's also very tacky, which I like. So, the look that I really want to do is this look right here. Um, that Kim Kardashian, well, makeup by Ariel, um, did it. Her makeup looks so good. I mean, her face is just flawless like Kim Kardashian just has a flawless looking face so I was like I need to do something like that even like my hair too like I need to recreate something like that you know I'm gonna first obviously do the eyes I feel like on the eyes he did such an amazing job so yeah I'm gonna start by the eyes and I'm gonna take a concealer brush And all I'm going to do is just prime my eyelid. Then I'm going to set it with this Too Faced powder. And I actually really love this powder right here. Okay, so for today's palette, I'm very excited. I don't know if, she, if um, makeup, bar, makeup by Ariel used... Is it Ariel or Ariel? Ariel? I don't know what palette he used. I don't think it, it, it even says what palette he used. All I know is that they're very, very warm tone. I really wanted to use this palette right here from Charlotte Tilbury. Um, I've never tried her eyeshadows. I've only tried a couple of them, but not like this right here this this is actually the charlotte tilbury pillow talk instant eye palette and the colors are in here are just super beautiful look how beautiful these are and i'm glad that there's like a lot of cool tones you know i mean um, a lot of warm tones which is a good thing i'm going to be taking a little bit of this shade right here in the palette and all i'm going to do is focus this color like on the crease as my transition shade So in the picture, it looks like he really just focused the colors more on the outer corner than in the inner corner. There's literally like no, I feel like there's no eyeshadow in here. So I'm going to try to like not even touch this part of my eyes. So it, you know, looks identical. But this color right here is kind of perfect. Like, I think I nailed it with this color, guys. And it looks like he did kind of like a wing eyeliner. So I'm going to try to do that too. And Kim Kardashian has such a pretty eye. Um, like a good eyeshadow eye, you know. So I think I'm going to go a little darker. I'm, I'm going to be using this shade right here. A little bit of this to darken just 
the outer corners. But when I'm done with this, I'm gonna go ahead and take this right here because I don't have anything else. And I'm gonna take that dark shade. All I'm gonna do is kind of lean it over to this, like that, and then just do the line that I want to do. I think I'm gonna darken it because it looks kind of darker in the picture. I think she used, I think he used like a really dark brown and this palette, thank God, has dark brown. I'm gonna take now a different brush and then uh, taking this, taking this brown shade in the palette and I'm pretty much gonna do the same thing that I'm just gonna keep it in here. Not super far up, just right here. So um, it looks like she has a liner kind of thing going on. So that's what I'm going to do too. Um, <laughs> I'm going to take that brown shade again. Now I'm going to do is just press this color. It looks like the eyeliner was kind of brown, but then it got darker. Um, I think the lashes made it look a little dark. And I'm going to put this black eyeshadow. It's actually from the Jackie Aina palette. And I'm literally just stamping it on. I'm going to be using this shade right here in the Charlotte Tilbury palette. It's like a bone color. really like it. And I'm just going to apply this kind of all over the lid. And it looks like like right in here she has a little bit of glitter going on so I'm gonna do that and see how it turns out taking this brush right here from morphe it's super 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 little like super little I'm actually going to be taking the Kylie cosmetics palette and I feel like this shade right here is perfect for that yeah she has it like right in here Looks like he kind of like spread it all over, kind of like that. As you guys can see, there is a little bit of glitter going on in this, like right here in the inner corner. Okay, so I'm going to leave the eyes for right now. Um, I feel like I'm like obsessing over how she is looking. So I'm going to focus now on my foundation and she has a really flawless foundation on so I mean a flawless canvas I mean she's beautiful she's just Kim Kardashian so I'm gonna be taking this milk primer I'm just going to be and now I'm gonna be taking the Ciate primer and I'm just going to 
prime my face. So now I'm going to be taking my Too Faced, I have like no more. And then I'm going to be taking my fan. So now I'm going to be taking this a Giorgio Armani Longwear High Cover Foundation. And I'm just going to be dotting this all over my face. And I'm just going to blend it out now. kind of light for me but I am going to be toning it down a little bit with my bronzer so it's totally fine So now that we have our foundation good to go, I feel like it oxidized a little bit and I'm loving that because I thought it was going to be a little light for me, which is weird because for the um, Luminous Silk, I am 6.25. For today's concealer, I'm going to be taking the Hourglass um, Vanish Concealer and this is in the shade Sienna and all I'm going to do is apply this underneath here and now I'm going to blend it out this is actually my first time using these concealers and I'm liking them So now I'm going to be um, putting my powder and today I'm actually going to be taking this powder right here from Too Faced. I'm going to be setting my under eyes with this um, powder in the shade Sand. So I'm just going to look up and I'm just going to set, 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 set like this. Look how like nice and blur that I just made my under eye. I'm going to be taking a little bit of the Huda Beauty powder. I'm just going to do bake a little bit underneath. I always like to do this just to secure my under eye. So now that we have that set, I'm going to go ahead and now set my whole entire face. Um, I'm going to be setting it with the Sephora powder. This is any shade bronze, no, matte tan. And I love, 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 love taking this powder to set my whole entire face. I feel like it just gives you a, like a really nice coverage. I'm going to be taking my Fenty Beauty bronzers. First, I'm going to be taking Island Tings. And all I'm going to do is just bronze up. Kim Kardashian is always bronzed. So now I'm going to be taking this shade, Bajan Gyal. Don't know how to pronounce it, but I'm just going to be taking this and just applying this all over. And then I'm going to be taking my powder and just dusting my powder away. 
All right guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and do my eyebrows off camera and then I'll be right back. Okie dokie, so now I'm gonna do the bottom lash line and I'm gonna be taking same exact eyeshadows I did on the top to the bottom and I'm just going to be blending this out. She has a really like smoked out bottom lash line, so that's what I'm trying to accomplish here. Alright guys, so now that we're done with the eyes, I feel like the eyes were a good achievement. I thought I wasn't going to get them, to be honest. I thought I was going to fail at doing the eyes, but I feel like I nailed it a little bit. But now I'm going to do my highlight, my favorite part. I am going to do a little bit of highlight. I'm not going to go super crazy because, you know, it is a matte look. So I'm just going to apply a little bit on the highest points of my cheeks. That's literally it. So the eyelashes I wore today are the Lily Lashes in the style NYC. Um, I was gonna go for a more natural lash, but I feel like I feel like Kim Kardashian looks good with certain lashes, but then with other lashes she doesn't. If that even makes sense. So I feel like these fit my eyes pretty good. I don't know. I feel like they, they just go with my eye shapes. That's why I chose these lashes. And highlight the inner corner. She did highlight the inner corner a little bit. I feel like it's the perfect matte eye. I'm obsessed with it. Like, honestly, I never thought I was going to be, like, super in love with a matte eye. I mean... I feel like I always do red eyes, but you guys know what I'm saying. <laughs> but now I'm going to do my lip. The lips she did are kind of nude. She's wearing kind of like a nude kind of lip. And I feel like this lip, I love wearing that kind of lip. And I'm going to be adding a little bit of my Impulsive MAC lipstick. And then I'm going to be taking this Kylie Cosmetics Nova lipstick. And I'm just going to apply this on the center. Alright guys, so this is pretty much it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do my hair like how she has it on the picture. So I'll be right back. But yeah, this is it. <laughs> Alright guys, so that's pretty much it for this look. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I freaking loved how everything turned out. It's a very, very soft glam. I mean, this is like traditional Kim K look. So I'm just so obsessed with it. As always, please don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you liked the look as much as I did. Thank you so much for watching my video. And if you guys want to continue to see more content from me, then don't forget to press the bell notification so you guys can get notified every time I upload new videos and new content for you guys so yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys on my next video bye guys